My name is Corey Linneman. My colleagues and I here at West Virginia University, at the University of Arkansas for Medical Sciences, and at the Oregon Health Authority have collaborated on this paper entitled Reconceptualizing Attrition in Parent-Child Interaction Therapy, Dropouts Demonstrate Impressive Improvements. Parent-Child Interaction Therapy, or PCIT, is an evidence-based behavioral parent training program for children ages two to seven years and their caregivers. PCIT can be used to treat children with disruptive behavior, ADHD, anxiety, autism spectrum disorder, trauma histories, and a variety of other behavioral problems. Treatment typically lasts for about 12 to 20 one-hour sessions. PCIT's large effect sizes draw on unique factors, including live therapist coaching of the caregiver during interactions with the child, data-driven assessment and treatment, and caregiver skill mastery-based criteria for progression through treatment. PCIT consists of two treatment phases. The first phase, child-directed interaction, focuses on relationship building between the caregiver and the child, in which the caregiver learns to use the pride skills which are praising, reflecting, imitating, describing play, and enthusiastically enjoying the child. The second treatment phase, parent-directed interaction, consists of compliance training, wherein the caregiver learns to give effective commands with consistent follow-through. Here's an example of PCIT in action. Although an extensive literature supports the effectiveness of PCIT, attrition prior to treatment completion remains a problem, with community-based dropout rates being reported from 12 to 67 percent. Attrition statistics in PCIT refer to those families who do not officially graduate according to the standardized mastery-based graduation criteria. This study includes a sample of 1,318 children and their caregivers who were referred to PCIT across the state of Oregon. We compared changes in caregiver-reported child behavior problems on the Iberg Child Behavior Inventory, or ECBI. We found that for families who attended at least four sessions of PCIT, even those who dropped out of treatment before meeting graduation criteria, reported post-treatment child behavior problems within the non-clinical range with an effect size of 0.7. Those who graduated from treatment achieved an effect size of 1.65 for behavior problem change. We concluded that PCIT was effective even for those families who did not graduate from treatment and that greater treatment gains occurred for those who did officially graduate.